Mrs. Osnachi, Mwachuku's elder sister, Favor Made, has come through to reveal crazy and yet believable details about her husband that allegedly led to her death, who kicked her in the chest consistently until she went unconscious and then died out of blood clotting around the chest. Mwachuku's elder sister revealed that her husband, Peter Wachuku, had no job. He just had to carry the title of being a pastor. So in case, I don't even care if he was a pastor, but this is a trend within Christianity in Nigeria. A lot of ministries raise pastors that end up not doing anything. They don't learn skills. They don't have businesses. They don't have jobs. They only depend on the sow seed on the, in the pastor's life. Sow this one. Give the pastor this. Give the pastor that. Yes, of course, you can do that. It is it is something we can do. It is something we consistently do. But pastors and men of God need to learn to have a job and something to do. That is why most of them go around taking and taking and taking, building mansions, owning crazy uh, buildings and businesses and private jets, and a lot of their followers are suffering. Of course, many of you will come, oh, why are you bashing pastors? Why would you say what you don't understand or what you don't know? This was revealed by her own elder sister. Look below. It was an official interview with the Vanguard uh, newspaper. So what are you saying? It is not me speaking against Christianity, against the church or anything, but this has to stop where pastors don't do anything. How can her own husband, because he was jobless, he was her manager. He controls the song she sings, chooses the language and dialect she sings it in. And if he was displeased by anything, he could slap his own wife at a studio with a producer, with other people in his presence. Sometimes he walks away in anger. Who does that? Sadly, it only got to this point because the church and many men of God out of their own self gratification and self understanding has taught many women to persevere in the wrong situations you don't persevere when you're being tormented when you're being troubled even in your service to god it, it is it is crazy and i feel this has to stop